Okay, hello everyone, it's a pleasure for me to announce that Cesar is here to share his topic with us. And Cesar, please introduce yourself and your topic. Hi everyone, my name is Cesar Palacios and my topic for today is the gender and the uh, weight gap. Okay, so please tell me, what do you mean with the wage gap? The wage gap is like, well, uh, today I'm going to compare the salaries between the uh, female actress and male actress and what does the, what is the reason that the salary of the male address are higher than the female address. Okay, so Cesar, tell me, uh, why does this gap exist or what are the main causes? Well, I think that the most important uh, cause is the visibility of the public that, the, for example, the, the female sports resist because you can compare the competition, for example, the soccer, uh, the, the first league, of soccer from England as uh, for men than as for women because for example the most quality of uh, cameras uh, interest is going to be on the uh, main teams why is, what, is, what is the reason? I think that for example the well the people in general are most uh, well they are they usually uh, when they want to watch a, a soccer match or a competition or sport they usually are going to put the main competition because I think it it could be uh, more interesting or probably more with a a higher level of competition. Okay, so Cesar, have you ever watched a women's soccer match? Yes, I have. I remember that it was like when uh, two or three years ago I remember that I was at the restaurant eating my lunch and I changed the channel and I realized that uh, at, the, at that time the Women World Cup of Soccer uh, started mm -hmm. and for example I decided to watch the entire second half time of that match and I find uh, some films because uh, at some point of, the, of that match it could be a little bit boring because I don't because uh, for example I'm, I didn't used to uh, watch this kind of competition every or for example for every sports for women I just watch like the tennis uh, match matches between the uh, female athlete but I had never uh, seen a, a soccer a female soccer match and it, but for example my conclusion of that match is a uh, world like it's it could be better but I don't know did you enjoy it? yes I enjoyed it because for example I think that the, the level of both team uh, were very equalized, were the same. And uh, for example, I think that it, uh, well, I think that in that point it could be a uh, better interest between the uh, a match female soccer between the soccer with a match of male team. Mm -hmm. Okay. So now, um, I would like to know if um, or how does the wage gap affect in a sport? Well, I think that uh, it didn't affect uh, it currently, but for example, I think that uh, in the most of the cases, it's just the, uh, well, I think that it's just the women that have this kind of, of for example, this kind of feeling that they deserve more attention, more promotion, and I think that they had a, they had a point, mm -hmm. but for example, I know I don't know if the brands and the teams had the no solvency to pay the same salary for them that they pay to the main teams. We mm -hmm. have a, a big discussion and a big problem here. Okay. So uh, in which sport does this gap occur? Well I think uh, the most clearly when you 
can see a uh, small screen in soccer mm -hmm. because, for example, uh, I remember that the last contract that Lionel Messi is in, mm -hmm. in Barcelona, in Barcelona's team, uh, he seems uh, he signed sorry he signed uh, uh, six hundred million uh, per four years, and it's just the salary of the contract. And for example, I think that the entire women team from Barcelona just earned the the half of the total salary of Lionel Messi, and it's a big difference. But we have some some tips here. Just Messi, for example, Messi and Ronaldo, these uh, those guys or oh, those yeah, those guys are for the young are brands and they generate me a bunch of expectation, a bunch of sellings, a bunch of interest, and also they generate. Uh, too much money for the young teams and for the young brands also. So in that case, they are earning what they generate. Okay. So what would you say to female athletes facing this situation? Well, I don't know. It could be difficult, but for example, if you if you think if you think on it, and uh, probably the salary, for example, the salary of the entire team of Barcelona's female team, mm -hmm. well, they win, they win, they sorry, they earn it, uh, that salary because of the because of the main team, what they generate, the interest for the fans, the interest for the public in general, and the type of competition that they have, because for example, we can also today we we can compare the promotion that. Uh, that is, for example, the, that the competition for for men in soccer had with the promotion of the police and uh, also the yes the could be the level of the female team soccer had is some it could be a it could be very difficult but today I think that with a with a correct use of the promotion of the publish and also the, the social media, the the interest for the people in general could be improved for watch the, those, uh, this kind of competition. Okay, so what could be done to reduce this gap? <laughs> what could be? I don't know. It's it's something it's something very difficult to it's very difficult to find a good way. For example, it's very difficult to find a good way in order to solve that problem. In we, for example, uh, each side uh, finish uh, correct or for example, uh, we 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 need to to find a good way in order to stay to keep in keep happy each each size mm -hmm. the men the men side and also the women side that they they are the they are for example they are the in the most common the cases they suffer this kind of situation but it's very difficult. Okay. So uh, do you practice any sports? Yes I have. Uh, is there this gap in the sport that you practice? Uh, no. Uh, because for example uh, I just practice sport in order to enjoy myself and, and not in order to like uh, building a, a whole life for take for the sports. I just uh, did that uh, for enjoying myself and for have a have a, a better lifestyle. But also I think that for example in my sport, in my specific sport that I that I that I practice. Uh, for example, in Karate, I think that we had the same opportunities for, have, uh, for, have, for example, to be in the top of, of, the, of the list and in that way. And I think that it could be, <coughs> sorry, well, in that way, I think that we don't have this kind of discussion or this kind of problem, but for example, in, in other in other 
other sports like soccer and also basket the the main the main focus are in the main in the in the side of the main I think that they also have this kind of of problems and also and more because we are in, in a, we are in Latin. Okay, so are there challenges that your female teammates have to face in your sport? Uh, no, well, we, well, I would say that for example the top of the athletes in my sports, uh, they are women mm. and they are for example I remember that here in the club we have a top five uh, athlete from karate here in Ecuador and also two or three more women and also we have for example and the representation of men is a little bit weak mm. because for example we just have one man that, that are in the in the top of the of the young category but the rest are women. Okay, good. So, uh, Cesar, tell me what uh, is the sport important for society? I think that this sport is important for the society because, for example, as one of my uh, sorry, her classmates say, Tatiana, she said that uh, if we can include, well, if, we, if we can generate a new athlete, uh, it doesn't matter the gender, uh, man or women. Mm -hmm. If we can, if we if we can generate a new uh, atom, a new yeah, a new atom, we we are <coughs> we are winning the battle against the against and all the mafias that we have here in in Ecuador and Latin America also. And for example, I think that. Uh, the people that just practice any kind of sports in order to enjoy the, themselves and to have a better lifestyle is a is one of the best ways that you can spend your, your free time mm -hmm. because for example uh, you can improve also your, your lifestyle you can improve I don't know, your movement your 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 ways that you think you can for example uh, I think that if you want to practice chess or other sports that requires more, more, I would say that more intelligent or more, uh, you need to have a faster thinking. You can improve that in that way. And also ping pong. I think that for practice ping pong, if you want to practice that, you are going to improve your, your, yeah. Your thinking and also your your movement because you are going to be a little bit faster. Okay, so um, would you like to add something else for your topic? Uh, well, actually, yes. Well, in order to continue with the difference uh, of waking up, we have here in the in that photo uh, Serena Williams and Naomi Osaka. And they are all well, they were also the the the, the the they were in the top of the list of women athletes but uh, of the salaries but for example and the fourth magazine and uh, selling that, that list with a uh, for example with the summary of of all of the of all of the things that that they win like promotion they contract with the with the young brands and other things but for example when they when they sell in the the list of men they just focus on the contracts and the difference is it's very long because we are talking like the Serena Winner and Naomi Osaka when we mix both contracts, both salary, we have the result that uh, both uh, wins in the 2021 year. They probably win uh, at least so, uh, 50 million dollars mix both salary. But for example, when we just focus on on the list of men, just uh, 
Messi win more than both. Mm -hmm. And it's a big question. And well, also, I got this, this, this example. And in, the, in, in this side, we had Shohei Otani, and on the other side, we had Iga Shibate. Those are the best paid athletes in both gender, both gender, sorry. But for example, just the salary of Shohei Otani that, for example, in the free agency, he seen a contract for 10 years, and he's, he's, uh, he's coming to win uh, $70 million uh, for a year. Just a contract that Shohei Otani is seen with Los Angeles Dodgers. And for example, in, in the case of Egan, and the, the last year she, she won a, a 21.2 million dollars. That is the result of the summary of all of the, of all of the salary that they have for their own brand, for the competition also. And it's a big difference. It's like Otani it had the the double salary of the Iga had in one, in one year, and it is like a big, a big difference we can see, and and also in a different sport because Shohei Otani is from baseball and Iga is from tennis, and also we got I think that those are the most common reason and the principal causes of the of the waging gap, the pure show. Because, for example, you can compare, for example, a grand final of a, of a, I don't know, whatever kind of male competition to whatever kind of female competition. Because the, could be the, I don't know, the interest that the, the, the public or the people in general gives to them. Because, for example, just in, in Super Bowl and then for example in those sports that are more common in, in USA and those sports when they uh, when they arrive at their own at their own final the public are uh, are by are very sorry the public just uh, basically focus on watch that game just for that year and the <coughs> and I remember that for example in the in the Super Bowl, the the totally of the people that that were uh, watching the the final is uh, were like uh, fifteen million mm -hmm. of Americans and also uh, public from other countries. But what is that? Because is because for example the the competition had a had good promotion and also they have uh, they they know how to use the social media. Yes? For example, if you you have never uh, you have never uh, heard about a uh, Super Bowl, probably you are going to watch something on Facebook or maybe on Instagram, and YouTube, in whatever kind of social media. And this generates to you a little bit interesting, a, a little interest. And you probably are going to watch the, the final, even if you have never uh, seen a, a match of, of football America or an NBA match. You are going to watch it because they they <coughs> they send to you a, a message or in the in the shadow could be that generates to you a, a interest. Okay. So finally, Cesar, I would like to know what is your final conclusion about this topic. Well, my final conclusion is, uh, well, first, the competition of the shows, the shows that, uh, for example, when I talk about the female soccer generated to the public, uh, needs to improve because, for example, in I remember that one of the most important uh, athletes female athlete from the soccer uh, female team uh, from USA and she said that she, she deserved to earn the same salary 
da Messi o Ronaldo earn. Uh -huh. And the public just explode because uh, the, the level of the, the level of the skills and the promotion is totally different. And I also think that the teams and the brand have the, have the solvency to use their own resources in order to improve the promotion and the visualization of those sports. And I think also, for example, we don't need to focus on just on, on those kind of sports, soccer, football, uh, basketball. Uh, we have uh, some other sports that are specified, specified for women like uh, gymnastics or some other that could be improved their own promotion. Uh, in, for example, in that case, obviously, uh, with that promotion, or for example, of dynastic, obviously, the, you are generating uh, interest in the interest in the people in general, and they probably are going to watch uh, more match for well, more uh, more action for uh, female sports in general, in football, in basketball, in tennis. When I think that also in tennis is the is the probably well I think that I I'm going to use the, the example of the tennis because for example in the tennis they they use the resources and the promotion equalize for both gender because you can for example I can well I took it for, for myself I can enjoy a match between uh, I don't know uh, Rafael Nadal and Nova Djokovic in the same way that I that I would enjoy uh, uh, watching a match watch a match between Naomi Osaka and Serena Williams because for example I think the level and also the promotion that they receive and the interest that they receive from the young public is the same and the competition is in the in the highest level of the uh, when we refer as a tennis uh, division. Okay. Mm -hmm. So that is all. Thank you so much. Thank you.